Hey everyone, it's Tom from Scranton Mixed Martial Arts. Wanted to answer a question and give some tips on how can a smaller person defeat a larger person. First, that's the foundation of everything we teach at Scranton Mixed Martial Arts. Our, our you know, main foundation art, Gracie Jiu Jitsu, is all about having a smaller person be able to defeat a larger person. Without getting into all the techniques and everything behind it, I just want to give you a few tips today that'll you know, give you some ideas on how you can do that. The first is we want to take the attacker out of their element, right? Most attackers want to make something about uh, like their plan. They want to turn it into a boxing match and we want to get the fight away from that. Uh, another thing we want to do is we want to turn the fight from a strength-based outcome into a more technical outcome, right? So if you know what you're going to do, that'll help you. If you're more technical, if you have better timing, better technique, that'll lead you to victory as well. And the last tip I want to give you real quick is you want to use your uh, your muscle, more of your body parts to attack smaller body parts on the attacker. So a quick example is you want to use your whole body to attack someone's elbow. You want to use your whole body to attack someone's wrist. My favorite, you want to use your whole body to attack someone's neck and choke them unconscious. So those are some quick tips that'll allow a smaller person to defeat a larger attacker. If you have any questions, please just let me know. Thanks.